Hello Capricorn and welcome to your Astro Flower reading. This is going to be a reading for the 27th right through to the 24th, uh, 27th right through to the 4th of April. Um, please do uh, subscribe and click that bell to see all sort of future content which is like this which I know you enjoy. So let's just have a quick look at your reading here. This is for the week. Uh, on the right hand side we have the uh, relationships and the emotional side. This is all to do with money, finances, jobs, uh, projects, that sort of thing. And this is the energy that's coursing through you at this present time. So, Capricorn, it's been pretty difficult for you guys, I think, over the last couple of weeks. Very trying emotionally, uh, not only on the relationship side, but also on the physical side. But that's all got to do with that water and the air that you have at the base of you. So you're really churning up those ideas at the moment, and those emotions cutting and slicing and dicing all through you. So, um, and you can see that within your relationship side. There is a way um, at the moment where you're getting passionate about life again. Uh, you may have lost your mojo a little bit last week, but certainly uh, this week here, it seems to be coming back within you on the relationship side. Um, but it's going to ask you to be a little bit more sort of um, smarter about how you place your emotions in the world and the outside universe or the outside world may be trying to trigger you constantly emotionally don't bite on it just don't don't bite on that hook that you know that 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 fishing hook that they put down for you it's not going to serve you anything it's where you've got your fire at your base as well so that's how it triggers you and it is that fire that does come in from Aries as well so in the emotional side of life and uh, the relationships side of life, keep, remain passionate about life. Remember who you are. Remember where you're from, what you've been through. It's not really a lot going on in the way of sort of lovers, although you probably would like there to be. But there doesn't seem to be many connections seem to be going on at the moment. It seems this week it's all about positioning and it's the long road. So this week here, I would put it out there, be passionate about what you're doing, get very social and stuff like that. But don't pin your tail to any donkey. You know, uh, this week here, be smart. Keep yourself in a little bit in reserve, you know. On the physical front, on the materials, that's money, jobs, uh, businesses and projects that are coming out for you. Uh, there's definitely a new journey. You want to do things a little bit differently. It doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to be stopping your job or giving up your business or, uh, you know, turning your back on a project. That's not it at all. What it cases this week, and it seems to be the similar sort of thing for your opposite sign of cancer, is basically reassessing your situation. Um, and when you reassess your situation, that could be your job, that could be your business or your projects. If you're reassessing the situation, it's like starting new again. And this is what is going to be coming through you. And I wouldn't put up for, I wouldn't put up with um, people that try to smudge you. You know what I mean? Sort of say, oh, well, we can't really do it like this. Maybe we could do it. No, no, no. I want it like this and this is how it's going to go. You can throw a bit of tantrums out there. Be careful of it. Don't do too much because you will alienate people, alienate business partners or alienate uh, people that you work with. But actually stand up for yourself is probably a good idea this week. And to marry, and now you're going to be able to sort of, and what's coming through by the end of the week, you're probably going to be able to marry that material or those projects in your life and your relationships and your emotional side of yourself, which is what you're looking for. This is your goal within you, because that's the energy that's running through you this week. You have the lover's card and you have the knight of pentacles. And in that sort of lover's card, I think it's more of a case, yes, there may be a case where you're going to be looking for a lover or new lover and etc. But this is more a case of falling in love with yourself. So do enjoy your life. Don't forget, if you want more content like this, please subscribe and click that bell because then you will get more content like this and it's going to help you out every week. OK, there is loads of other links in the description below this for our books, but there's also for our Instagram where we do giveaways and free giveaways such as a healing session or a reading for the Astro Flower. In the meantime, Capricorn, don't forget, life should be fun. So please do enjoy.